Scooby? Oh. oh, oh, hi, Polly. Scooby, you shouldn't be napping under the hot sun today. Mr. Wheeler passed out yesterday while he was working. It's dangerous. Oh, why was that? Because of the sun? That's right. So please go directly home after school is out, all right? Oh, well, I, um... Scooby, you promised that we'd play together after <laughs> school today, remember? Yeah. <laughs> Yay, we're, we're so, so excited! excited. <laughs> oh. Hmm. What's wrong? Is there a problem? <laughs> of course not. I'll go straight home. Hmm. What? Why are you canceling on us? I'm not canceling. I'm just postponing. Polly says that it's dangerous to be outside in this temperature. What's so dangerous about the weather? My family goes to the beach when it's hot in the summer all the time. That's right. What? Can't handle a little heat? Oh, yes, I can. I was just worried about the two of you. But you huh? promised! Oh. Liar! Uh, That's right! You uh, promised! Uh, guys, okay, all right, I will take you. Really? Yes, you bet. <laughs> Woo! Uh. And let's go! Oh, it's really hot. Scooby! What is it? I think you're conditioner is broken. It's too hot in here. Sorry. I'll open the windows up. Oh, that's even hotter. I can't breathe. I want to get out. Yes, Colby. Oh. Please. Okay. Uh, uh. Uh, come out. Uh. I don't feel well. Uh. Uh. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna throw. Ah, I have to do something. Wait right here. I'm calling the rescue team. Hopefully they can help. My head hurts. Back to the children. Oh, why am I so sleepy? Oh, oh. Don't worry, we're here to help. But where is Scooby? Scooby left to call you, but never came back for us. Holy, I'll go take care of the children. You and Roy go find Scooby. Okay. okay. Sit here in the shade and drink this water. I'll better. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Scooby! Can you hear us? Scooby! Bully? Bully! I'm here! I'm coming! Scooby! Huh? There! Huh? I see Scooby! Hmm. Oh, I feel woozy. And I'm having trouble steering. Oh. Watch out! I can't stop! It's your turn, Roy! Is everyone all right? We're okay, but Scooby is overheated. We have to get him into the shade and cool down. Okay, let's do it! Hmm. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> I feel better now. Hmm. Uh, 
What's this? Oh, that. That's the good conduct medal that I was awarded when I was young. A good conduct medal? That means you served your country, right? That's right. That's really yeah. incredible. Wow. It must be great to have a medal. Can I take a closer look at it, please? Sure you can. Wow. This is the coolest thing. <laughs> Well, I guess I'll go start cleaning up my office now. Miss Bell, wait. May I have the honor of helping you out with your office cleanup? Sure you can. Do you think you could start with the file cabinet? Yay! Oh, careful, Lifty. Like a perfect pour. Mickey! Huh? Mickey, you haven't seen my medal, have you? Sorry, Ms. Bell. No medal here. Oh. Well, now what? It's not like I can go out and replace it. Well, if it's not here, do you think someone took it? But who would do something like that? Unless... It's the coolest thing. Lefty, have you really not seen my medal? Not since yesterday. Wait, you don't think I took it, do you? Well, I know it was in one of the boxes you moved. But, Miss Bell, I would never take something that belonged to you without asking you first. What kind of friend do you think I am? I would never do that. <laughs> Lifty. Oh. Hmm. Oh. <gasps> what if I dropped the medal out of the box by accident? <gasps> then it is my fault. What do I do now? Oh, where is it? Where can it be? <sighs> it's not here. I don't see it anywhere. Huh? Hmm, could that be it? <laughs> oh, this isn't even close. Come on, Lucky, hurry up. <laughs> oh, put it down, put it down. What, what did, did you, you just, just say? say? It's me, Lefty. Huh? Uh, what do I do? What do you think? Just put him down! Right! The uh, other way! Uh, I can't control myself! Something's wrong! My gears are still stuck! Check it out. Okay. Ah, uh, you have to fall out of the pie. Hold it steady, Lucky. But that's what I'm trying to do. Guys, hurry. Uh, 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 it's okay, Lifty. Help is coming. Okay. Uh, hold on. I'm working on it. Uh, Roy, put the ladder up. All right. All set. Lifty, come on out. Going down. <laughs> yeah. Good job. Nice work, Lifty. Precious metal huh? detected. Precious Hooray! Metal we found detected. it! Here you go! Huh? My metal! Lifty, it was here all along! Yeah. I'm so relieved! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> wow, Titan, you're an enormous truck. I huh. thought Terry was the biggest truck mm -hmm. in town, but I think Titan huh? is actually even bigger. <laughs> you think I'm really large? Bruner, Terry just isn't pulling his normal giant trailer today, that's all. If he were, he'd be bigger. Indeed. What are you talking huh? about? It's obvious Titan's much bigger, right, Mr. Builder? Hmm. Well, they look pretty much huh? the same. Huh? Let's all stop uh, this pointless huh? jabbering and get back to work, all yes. right? Yes! Fine. Titan, come on, friend. Let's go show them all how big you are. I really don't have time for these childish games. Then you're okay with everybody thinking Terry's much bigger than you are? Oh, well, I don't like hearing that at all. What? What on earth would Titan want to compare size with me for? Does it even make any sense to compare you to Titan? The whole thing just sounds sort of weird. Isn't there a better use of their time? Does it really matter if Terry's huh? bigger than you? It's obvious Titan's much bigger. Well, that really wasn't very nice. All right, let's go and check out how big you are so they won't compare you with Titan anymore. All right, but I'm wearing a container. Let them see what an actual piece of heavy machinery looks like. Right on! Go get them, Terry! And are you ready for this? Well, they have actually been saying that I'm the smallest one in the entire town. But it's clear that Posty is quite a bit smaller than I am. I mean, it's hard not to take this stuff huh. personally, right? Is it me? Or isn't this a matter of pride in yourself as a vehicle and our pride as workers at the harbor? We'll be all right. Everybody's waiting. Let's hurry up. Huh? Yeah. Lifty, hold on. What's up? My trailer. I think it's stuck. What? Well, there's something you can do about it, right? Something like crouch down? It wouldn't work. I forgot that I'm not supposed to pass under here with a container on. You're not? Oh. Sounds like a great plan. Then Amber and Helen, you take the air out of the tires while Roy and I move the container. Okay. <sighs> Done, Polly. Right, now let's move the container out. Okay. All right, huh. lift! Huh. Uh. Uh. Now to refill the tires. Uh. They're all done. Thanks so much. Yeah, all right, Terry's out. <laughs> <laughs> Well, are you both ready? Yes! Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Huh? Um, your height is almost the same. Right, huh? just an acorn size apart. The size 
size of an acorn. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there's a Scooby rumor that's spreading all over town. Rumor? Yeah, they say in town that Scooby goes out at night and drives everywhere all covered in mud. Now, why would a grown school bus want to do something strange like that? <laughs> Scooby, your little secret will be revealed tonight. How come nothing's happening? Huh? There he goes! Road? Wait a minute. Scooby said his nightmares were about these exact same things. In my nightmare, I'm driving across Owl Valley Bridge and it's just so dangerous that I'm on a road completely surrounded by thorns. Then I'm driving headlong into the swamp. That means the swamp's next. Scooby! Uh, ow! Huh, Scooby! Stop! Oh, Scooby! Scooby! Please stop! Uh, come on! Are you sleeping? Rescue Scooby before he wakes up! Amber, we need to pull him together, so give us a three count. Oh, right! Uh, Helly, how about a little light? Sure thing! Everybody ready? Yes! yes. All right, three count, then pull. One, two, three! Uh, pull! Uh, pull! Uh, Almost! Uh, pull! Hey! Calm down, Scooby. Just stay calm. Scooby, wake up! It's not a nightmare. What? I'm not having a nightmare, Scooby. Uh, uh, Amber, uh, it's real. We're trying to pull you out of the swamp. Uh, I don't understand. I was sure that I was just dreaming. Scooby, we're going to get you out of there, all right? Just hold on a little longer. Thanks. Uh, yeah, I'll try. Uh, Roy, let's try again. Ready? Pull. Right. Uh, uh. <laughs> what? Sleepwalking? But what is sleepwalking? Sleepwalking is when someone walks around when they're actually asleep. It can happen because someone is experiencing extra stress or isn't getting enough rest. Ah, uh, my nightmares. I wasn't just dreaming, it was all actually happening. That's where all of those mysterious scratches came from. Then you weren't actually out late playing every night. You were sleepwalking instead. Do you have any idea when this might have started? I guess it hmm. was just about a week ago. <gasps> that morning I woke up late because the alarm didn't go off. The children were about to be late to school because of me. I was rushing to the bus stop, swerving and yelling. Oh! After the accident, I started worrying about all kinds of stuff. If the alarm had gone off properly, I wouldn't have been late. And if I hadn't been late, I wouldn't have gotten into an accident. That's when I started having nightmares. What's oh. going to become of me if I keep sleepwalking? I'll sink into the swamp. Or even worse, I might be late. 
don't worry. Sleepwalking is curable. Uh, you're sure? I am. Ball game, ball game, <sighs> ball game, ball game, ball game! Okay, just go and get the ball. The crew is all waiting for us. <laughs> Woohoo! Ball game, ball game, ball game! <sighs> I wish I could just take him somewhere far away and leave him. Leave him? There we go! That's a fabulous idea! Okay, I got it! Are we ready to play? <laughs> Bruni, so do you want to hmm? learn this new game that I know? Yeah! Well then, you need to find a ladder. You've never played a game this fun in your entire life! A ladder? Where am I supposed to find one? Look over there, behind huh? Mr. Builder's house. You can handle it on your own. I mean, you're strong enough, right? Yes! I'm totally strong! Woohoo! A ladder! A ladder! A ladder! A ladder! A ladder! Bye, Bruni. I'm sorry. I just can't do this today. <laughs> Hello? Bruner? Where are you? Oh, there's that fun ride! Whoa! Going up! This is great! <laughs> Look how high! Bruner! Bruner! What's up, Bruner? You keep missing it. Is everything all right? <laughs> yeah, sorry. I'll throw it again. I have to say, this is more fun without your cousin. Yeah, no, I hope that Bruni's okay. Bruner, where are you? Yeah. I can't take it anymore. You guys huh? go ahead. I have to get going. You can play without me. Bruner? Uh, he's acting really weird. Yeah, Bruni. I hope nothing bad happened to him while I was gone. I never should have left him alone. Bruner! Yeah. Bruner! Now I'm even hearing his voice. Bruner! Yeah. Help! Bruni! Let's do this. <laughs> Bruni? Holy! Are you all right? Yes. We're all so proud of you for being brave, but let's get you out of here. Okay. Huh? That's causing this. We should hurry and get to the roof. Oh. Roy, pull us up. Right. Oh. <laughs> Rooney, nothing's going to happen to you. You'll be fine. Ah. <laughs> Come on. Uh, yeah. What's going on, Polly? We're all right. Great. Hold on. I'll pull you up. Thanks. Rooney, hold tight. Mm -hmm. We're going up. Okay. Oh. Oh. <sighs> this never would have happened if I hadn't left him all by himself. <laughs> Don't worry, Bruner. Huh? Bruni's going to be all right. Bruner, huh? over here. Why, Bruni. Hi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
It's all my fault. I'm so sorry, Bruni. <laughs> What an old-fashioned town. Hi, Camp. Good to see you. I am Helly of Broomstown Rescue Team. If you need any help, just ask. I'll come flying right away to lend a hand. Out of my way. You're tiresome. Huh? Uh, I'm tiresome? <laughs> Wait. Huh? You're not allowed to scribble there. A scribble? I guess you don't know me. I am a journalist from the famous magazine Travel is Fun, and this here is my signature. I hope you have a lovely visit. I'm Polly of the Broomstown Rescue Team. Oh, the rescue team again. Oh, it sounds like you've already met one of us. But still, you can't scribble on this nice monument. I said it's not a scribble. This is frustrating. In the future, that scribble, uh, no, I mean that signature will be the town's attraction. Hmm. Huh? Where are you going? This one might be a troublemaker. What, what, what? No camping allowed. Hello? Huh? Hi, would you be Camp the Writer? Oh, at long last, it's so nice to be recognized. Sure thing, I'm Roy of the Broomstown Rescue Team. Another one? Yet you look a little bit smarter than the others. You should know that I'm going to be camping here tonight. Camp here? That's not going to be possible. This dry weather makes forest fires more likely. Camping just isn't allowed here. Well, you are just the same as the hovering pest, nagging police car, and meddling ambulance. And now to top it all off, a terribly stubborn and nasty fire engine. What? Traveling to this place is proving to be dreadful because the rescue team's everywhere, ruining everything. Oh, what a horrible town. Oh? I don't see anyone. <laughs> okay, let the camping begin. Stars, romance, dust. Uh huh. <laughs> campfire, campfire, burning bright. Lighten up, you brighten up the autumn night. Sparking up the dark and making it feel all right. Campfire, campfire, shine your light. Oh, what on earth is that smell? Oh, goodness. Oh, oh no, this isn't what I intended at all. got a fire to put out. We will handle what's left of the fire. Let's do this. Oh, 
one slightly charred ukulele. I'm glad that you didn't get charred as well. We're happy you're safe. We're under a hurricane warning for the next several hours here in Brimstown, guys. Now, the storm could be quite large, so all of us have to prepare just in case it does come. Don't you worry, Jin. We'll check every single part of Broomstown and make sure that it's prepared for the worst. <laughs> so we should split up to cover more ground since this is an emergency. Roy, listen, check the shoreline and the harbor. Mm -hmm. Amber, all the suburbs are yours. All right. And I'll handle the center of town. And me? I think you should stay here at headquarters. On a day like this, flying is just too dangerous. You don't have to worry. An old hurricane isn't going to keep me down. Helly, don't you remember the last storm? How your propeller got all messed up? The wind is several uh... times worse outside now than it was oh, then. Yeah, yeah Helly. Listen, listen to Jin because, because she's right. right. I'm not just sitting around while my town has a hurricane. I'm going to prove to you that I'm strong enough to do my job. <laughs> Helly! 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 Posty! Posty! Oh, Kelly! Uh, uh, what happened? Uh, I was on my way back from a delivery, and suddenly the bridge was just gone! It's too dangerous to try crossing here. We have to find shelter. Let's try to get to the mountain cabin. All right! Uh, uh, Posty, what's wrong? I just can't go anymore. No, you have to go inside. If you stay out here, the hurricane will blow you away. I can't. I'm out of power. Ow. Uh. Posty, wake up. Uh. Oh, no. I'll have to get an emergency charger. Hang on, Posty. Uh. I'll be back. Is he all right? He needs an emergency charge. Holy, Amber and I will handle this. You go on and look for Helly. Sure, you get him inside then. Don't, Don't worry. worry. Uh, uh, gotta get out. Uh, huh? My propeller's broken? Jin! Jin! Hey guys, please answer. <laughs> I can't get through. <laughs> Helly! Holy? Helly, hold on! I'll be right there! Hmm. Now I'm safe because Holy came! <laughs> you alright? Yes, but I'm not able to fly! You'll be fine. Let's get you out of here. I'll try, but can you really lift us both? You bet. Just believe in me. Nice. Let's hurry. The water is rapidly rising. Grab on. Okay. Going up. Uh, uh, is something wrong? Uh, uh, Holy, you all right? I'm fine. Trying again. Uh, uh, Kelly, are you all right? I'm just fine. Are you okay? I'm great. Let's try this one more time. Huh? Oh, yeah. Just a bit more. 
Uh, would you like a hand? Hi, Roy. Really nice timing, friend. Hosty, you guys! I'm glad you're all okay! Yeah! yeah. Car safety, told by Dad. <laughs> Whoa! Don't move, please! Susie? Huh? Can you help me? Sure! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Dad, when are you coming to be a guest teacher at our school? Uh, the truth is... I have zero experience with being a teacher. <laughs> but Doug's father came to school last week. Huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Ta-da! It's time for a yummy picnic! Huh? huh? <laughs> wow, the car looks new. Great! Thanks! Off we go! <laughs> Now, Polly, get ready to enter the wet part of the course. All set. Next up. <laughs> All right. Polly, excellent work. Good job. You too, Jin. You know, I really like these new tires. Now I won't have to be as concerned when I'm driving on rainy days. Hey, Dad, why do you keep looking at the mirrors? <laughs> well, son, they're like a third eye. The mirrors help me keep track of what the cars around me are doing. I see. <laughs> <laughs> Look, hurry and speed up before the light changes. Not a good idea, son. If the light turns red, we won't be able to stop. Ah! Hey, you almost ran me over. I'm so sorry. <laughs> wow. That was so close! At high speeds, it's very hard to stop. When you cross the road, never assume a car will be able to go around you. Make sure it's at a complete stop first. Okay! <laughs> huh? <laughs> hey! Susie! You know you can't use your hands! Yum! <laughs> and? Cheese! <Katie. laughs> hmm. Oh dear, looks like we're in for some bad weather this afternoon. You mean like rain? Remember that last storm? It was really horrible. We should do some safety checks around town. You're right, let's check it out. Hmm. Oh, we were lucky. Thank goodness we're out of the rain. Isn't it great to be safe in our nice car? <laughs> wow, Dad. It's really hard to see the road. True, son. It's dusk. Hard to see at this time of day, plus we've got all of this rain. Those two factors make driving a challenge. They're already fast asleep. Look out! <laughs> Is everyone okay? Yes, we're okay, Polly. Oh. Cars make our lives more convenient, and they're really good friends to us. But still, if we don't learn enough about them, they can be a lot like scary monsters. <laughs> now, what are some things we should know about our cars? First, moving cars cannot stop instantly, nor can they turn quickly. So if you see a car coming from a distance, you need to wait until it passes, or until it comes to a complete stop. Then you can cross. Second, when driving on either rainy or snowy slippery roads, cars can lose traction and start to skid. On rainy or snowy days, drivers have very low visibility. So if you're walking, make sure there's enough room between you and the road. And third, if you get into an accident in the car, you can hit something or even roll over. You could get really hurt. So the first thing you do when you get in the car is... Buckle your seatbelt! Couldn't have said it better myself. <laughs> <laughs> the car is 
back in it. <laughs> Good as new. Wow, it does look new, doesn't it? All right. We've got our car back. <laughs> Honey, do you think we should go out for dinner? Yay! Sounds great. <laughs> <laughs> A scary earthquake. Where did my seeds get to? Uh, uh, oh, 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 no! Oh, what on earth was that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited for the new Super Dragon action figure release! <laughs> Yahoo! Oh, Peter! Wait up! <laughs> is it here? The new Super Dragon action figure? <laughs> yep, here it is. Wow! The brand new limited edition Super Dragon with windshield wipers. It's so awesome. I want one. Hmm? <sighs> one moment, I'll be right back. Okay. This guy could totally be Dino King. Ha <laughs> ha! Easy. An earthquake? Really? It was. Everything just shook. <gasps> Earthquakes can be a big deal. Huh? What's this? Ah! Ah! Uh, uh, uh. <gasps> oh, no! Oh, wow! <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> oh, kids! <laughs> Here, this way. Oh, hey, are you all right? Yeah, I'm okay. You? Yeah, I'm all right. But what happened? Huh? Peter! Johnny! Huh? There's somebody over, over there! Mister! Hello! Somebody help us! I'm glad you're okay. Just hang on. I'll call the rescue squad. Mm. Huh? 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 Right. You're good to go. <laughs> Thank you so much, Roy. We're glad it wasn't mm. worse. Grandpa! I'm fine. Mm. Oh? Roy, something oh. happened. Peter and Johnny mm. are trapped in the toy store. Oh. Get there as soon as you can. Got it. Amber, can you take care of this? I got this. My, my, my. Uh, uh, how come it's not moving? Just keep trying. Hey, are we gonna be stuck here for the rest of our lives? What? No way! Probably. Huh? Huh? Johnny, check it out! Huh? Super Dragon Man is protecting us! Ah, <sighs> Super Dragon! Super, Super Dragon, Dragon, save, save us. us! No way! Just hang on! Huh? 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 You okay? Oh, Roy! Oh, Johnny, <laughs> we're gonna live! <laughs> I'm so happy! <laughs> Earthquakes are natural disasters that happen in certain areas. So now, let's go over what to do in an earthquake. In an earthquake, the ground shakes and buildings can get damaged. Don't try to run outside as fast as possible. Instead, hide under a desk or table. If there is no desk or table, run to the wall with your back against it and protect your head with cushions or blankets. If there's building damage, a door might not open. Open the doors right when the earthquake starts to avoid getting stuck. 
If you're outside, stay away from things that could fall over. Find a more open area. All good, you guys? Yeah. Ahem. So, earthquakes are really bad. The ground moves and everything's shaking and stuff. And we saw the entire thing. Hmm. <laughs> Earthquake! <laughs> that wasn't funny! Yeah, earthquakes are scary! <laughs> What? You mean Mom's birthday is today? That's right. We can celebrate with her tonight at the house. Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome! I hope the birthday cake is chocolate. No! Huh? Chocolate cake is only your favorite. It should be strawberry. No! Chocolate! Choco, choco, chocolate cake! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, uh, <sighs> oh, Peter! Always look where you're going. <sighs> huh? There's the bakery! Woohoo! <laughs> hey, wake up! <laughs> oh, kids will be kids. Wow! That chocolate cake looks so yummy. Look at the strawberry one. One cheesecake, uh, please. Huh? Not the chocolate one? Or a strawberry one? Huh? Cheesecake is your mom's favorite, you two. Here you go. Huh? Would you like that box? Yes, please. Mom. Huh? 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 Mm-mm. Huh? Huh? Mm-mm. Uh-uh. Ha-ha. And there you go. Good as new. Thank you, Amber. Oh, that elevator door caught her fast. Elevator doors can be surprisingly dangerous. We always have to be careful before we put our hands out. Make sure to look out, okay? Hm. Yes, I will. <sighs> this one's not too bad. <sighs> we haven't gotten to pick one thing. Hm. What are we supposed to do, not help pick out things for Mom? I know. Let's just go get her gift ourselves. But how? Shh. Mm -hmm. oh. <sighs> that ought to do it. Huh? Get back here! <laughs> Peter! Huh? Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> uh, stop! Daddy! Uh, uh, that was a close one. So you just wanted to pick something for Mom? Yes. We want to help decide stuff for Mom's birthday party. You won't listen to us. Mm -hmm. You got to pick everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, I guess you're right. And I apologize. Hey, why don't we pick mm -hmm. Mom's birthday gift mm -hmm. together? Yeah! <laughs> hmm. That one! Great. I'm sure she'll love it since it's from you. <laughs> All right! Well, it's time to head home. Daddy, my legs are tired. You want me to carry you, huh? Peter, think you can hold these? Yep. Ugh. Hey, Dad, when Mom comes home, first, let's wait in the dark. Then we can yell out surprise at her. That would be hilarious. <laughs> sure. Make sure you face forward and don't trip. We should totally do it. <gasps> Peter! Ah! Ah! No! Huh? Look out! <gasps> <sighs> Are you all right? Uh, yeah, I'm okay. Thanks a lot, Amber. That could have been truly dangerous. I know, Dad. I'm sorry for not being more careful. Peter, shopping malls can be fun, but we also need to stay safe. Escalators aren't places for playing. Don't mess around or face backward on them. Always hold on to the handrails. Watch out for things like loose shoelaces. If they get caught, you could trip, or worse. Kids shouldn't push shopping carts all by themselves. And if you're rushing to get somewhere, don't try and whiz past an automated door. Instead, wait a little while until the door opens fully for you. Cool, got that? Got, got 
it, Amber. <laughs> Robert, kids, I'm home. Huh? Ta -da! Today is your day. It's mommy's birthday. We love mom so much. Happy birthday to mom. <laughs> <gasps> this is for you! <laughs> they really wanted to pick out something. Aw, so nice. I just feel so loved. Thank you, guys. <gasps> of course! <laughs> <laughs> Don't run between cars. <laughs> Take that! Oh, yeah? Gotcha! <laughs> That's so cold. Mm. Oh, I'm really, really sorry, Mr. Musty. <laughs> oh, never mind. Now, let's see. I'm looking for Lewis's new house. Oh, I know where his house is. Over there. The house with the blue roof. Ah, <sighs> I see it now. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye, Mr. Musty. Huh? <laughs> hey, stop! Yeah, got That's you. not fair! <laughs> you snooze, you uh, lose! Stop! <laughs> Uh-oh, I'm running out of ammo. <laughs> My oh. turn! <laughs> oh, come on! Yeah. Stop! No! How do you like that? Uh. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, look! There are so many visitors here. I hope I can find a space. <laughs> if you put that big sign in this small alley, it could block a driver's view and cause a bad accident. Oh, right. So sorry. I'll move it now, Polly. Good. Have a nice day. Huh? If you park right in front of the crosswalk, the children won't be able to see when they try to cross the street. Huh? Right. I'll move now. Good. It's safe to cross. Thank you. Uh, um, it looks like huh? you're lost. Can I help you? Yeah? Oh, please! Where could he be? <laughs> This'll be great! Aha! I've got you now! <laughs> All the cars. Okay, Doug. I know you're here. <laughs> hmm. You want the house with the blue roof? I see. Thank you, Polly. Bye. See you later. Bye bye. Huh? Look at all the cars. So many parked on the street. Doug, I can't believe you two just ran out into the road. We're, We're really, really sorry, Polly. Did you know if you run in between parked cars, you're 18 times more likely to get into an accident? It's very dangerous. Did you say 18 times? Right. If small children like you pop out from between parked cars, it's nearly impossible for drivers to see you in time, and you could wind up getting hit. So whenever you have to walk out onto a road, 
If you're in a parking lot or near cars at all, you must look around first and then walk slowly and carefully. Even if you're at a crosswalk, you must never, ever run out in front of a bus or in between cars. Also, since you never know when cars are going to move, you shouldn't ever play around them even if they're parked. We hear you, Polly. <laughs> So we finally meet. It's time for a duel, partner. You're on. I'm gonna count up to three, then we draw. All right, partner. A one, two, three! three. <laughs> <laughs> so how do you like my monster hey, water gun, Pilgrim? That's not fair, Come dog. Come here, you Stop. Come on, dog. How to call 911. You guys, guess huh? what I heard? There was the most amazing shooting star last night. I saw it myself. Yeah, there was this crazy bright light oh. everywhere. Light mm -hmm. everywhere? Yeah, that's right. I've never seen a meteor. What do you think they look like? I heard it's just a rock that falls from oh. space. Just a rock? No way! It's got to be sparkly, like a Super Ball! The three of us are going to get to the bottom of this, you guys. Are you ready? Ready! ready. Magic dowsing rods to find its energy. A jumbo sausage, because we're out here for hours and I might get hungry! Alien communicator ham radio! Wait, how are any of those going to help us find a shooting star? Peter, you just brought sticks, and I'm pretty sure you can't eat those. Heh, <laughs> check this out. Ha! <laughs> Let's go, Super Dowsing Rods. Hmm, I felt it. This way, let's go. Uh, uh is he feeling okay? Who knows? Hmm. Are you sure this is how to get to the star? Of course it is. I totally know the way. Uh, 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 so, this is still the way? We'll be there in no time. Oh, over here. <laughs> so, you're still 100% sure? Yes, guys, I keep telling you I got this. <laughs> no, my sausage! <laughs> What is that? It's really dark in here now. But I know I saw something. Charles, hmm. is there a light over there? Hmm. Right here. <laughs> the shooting star! <laughs> wow. wow! That's gotta be it. Huh? Ah! We should call 911. But I don't have a phone or anything. Uh, oh, that's right. Your radio thingy. Rescue squad, Jin speaking. There's a fire. We don't know what to do. Where is it? Where are you guys? It's an old cabin in the middle of the woods. But I've never been here, so I'm not really sure. OK, remain calm and don't panic. Describe what's around. Do you remember how you got there? Got, got here? here? Um, uh, well, at one point the road forked and we went to the left, and later we crossed the river on a log. There was a cliff where we fell off. And that's how we found this cabin that's on fire. Hmm. Okay. Heads up, you guys. Huh? Oh. There's been a fire reported in the woods in a cabin. Hmm. I need you to get there. Hmm. Sending location now. Huh. Got, got it! Hmm. Helly, I'll head through the forest. You tell me where to go. You got it. Huh? Roy, head left. Thank you. Roy, Helly. Everybody safe? Yeah, we're Roy. okay. <laughs> Huh? <laughs>
This could have been a lot worse. But thanks to you kids, it was contained. Oh, that's, that's great. great. So anytime you see a fire, use a cell phone, pay phone, or any other phone and call 911. Always remain as calm as possible and describe exactly where the fire is. If the fire is somewhere you're unfamiliar with, look around for landmarks. Landmarks can be big buildings, libraries, schools, big trees, intersections, roundabouts, ponds, lakes, subway stations, or bus stops. This is so firefighters can find the fire more easily. Hmm. You understand? Yeah, Roy. Awesome. Why are you guys all the way out here anyway? Oh, the, the shooting, shooting star. star. Oh, no. Hmm. It would still be inside. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ta-da. I remembered to bring oh. it out. Oh. Yay. Yay, we, we got, got a shooting, shooting star. star. You guys found the meteorite? That's awesome! Everyone's been talking about that. Well done, guys! We found it! Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs>
All right, stand back. Hey, kids, you okay? you're all safe. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> when the snow is heavy, there are some things to remember. In winter, pay attention to weather forecasts to see how bad the snow is expected to be. On days with extra heavy snowfall, it's best to stay inside. And if you do go outside, remember to wear your gloves, a scarf, warm shoes, and something to cover your ears. Always tell your family where you're going and when you'll be back. If something happens and you need help, try as many ways as possible to signal for help. While you wait for help, move around to keep your body temperature warm and remain calm. Hmm, got it. We'll, we'll do, do our, our best. best. You guys! Huh? Huh? It just stopped snowing, so snowball fight? Really? All right, snowball fight! fight. Well, we do what we can. Hmm? <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Outlaw on the sidewalk. Ah, uh, I really don't like homework. Yeah, well, I'm so hungry. Doug, why don't we go play for a little while? We can't. Uh -huh. If we're late, Jenny will be mad. Yeah, you're right about that. Uh. Hmm? Oh, wow! Pizza! Huh? The first 100 customers get free pizza today? What? Free pizza? Yeah! Whoa. Let's go get some! <laughs> uh, hang on, but Jenny's still waiting for us. If we bring her some pizza, I bet she won't mind so much, right? You think so? Of course! <laughs> Excuse me, please. Pardon me, sir. Wow, there's no time to rest today. Okay, pizza's on the way. Uh, Kevin, are we almost there? Yeah, uh, we should be just about there. Let's oh. see. I think it's right around here. Huh? We, we found, found it! it! Time, time to, to eat! <laughs> <laughs> Huh? This is not the right place! Oh. We got tricked by that sign! Oh. Wow, traffic is so bad. Well, in that case... There! <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is 7th Street. <laughs> no. Sorry! Huh? So, I'm pretty sure we're just about there. Um... Huh? Hold on. Huh? I can smell it, Kevin. Uh, I can smell it. You go, Doug. Your nose is never wrong. <laughs> My nose says that we're getting close. Oh! Oh! oh. Huh? I found what? it! That's awesome! Where is it? Where? I'll take a hot dog, what? sir! What? Uh, awesome! Get uh, moving, Doug! <laughs> we're going to miss out on the free pizza! Uh, hot dog, come back! Oh. I think we're almost there. Are they really giving away free pizza today? That's what I heard. Huh? huh? All, All right. right! This way! Come on, let's go! <laughs> Phew, I've just got one more pizza to go. Should be around here somewhere. There! Huh? Why is that scooter on the sidewalk? Try to run faster! We're almost there! Uh, do you promise? It's a scooter! Hold on! Are you two all right? Oh, why do I 
easy to have everything. Don't you know? Motorized vehicles should never be driven on the sidewalk or on crosswalks. I don't know what to say. I didn't even realize I was on the sidewalk. <laughs> well, I guess we could have avoided her. That's right. No, that's huh? not right. If you should encounter a vehicle on the sidewalk, don't attempt to maneuver around it. Instead, stand in one spot. Or lean against the nearest wall. So, because motorcycles can move fast even on narrow roads, you have to be cautiously aware when you're going down a side street, getting off a bus, and even when you're walking on the sidewalk. Do you see, kids? You could have an accident if you run around recklessly the way you were. We get it, Polly. <laughs> no! no! We, we missed, missed the pizza! pizza. Oh. Oh. What took you two so long? We're real sorry, Jenny. Yeah, we're sorry. Well, hurry up. Your pizza's getting cold. What? Wow! Pizza! Mm. Oh, delicious! Mm. Hey, come on! One slice at a time! <laughs> the School Fire Drill Everyone, we have a new friend today! Whoa! Whoa. Someone needs to be in charge of feeding him. Oh, pick me! I can do it, pick me! Uh, um... Oh, Charles, how would you like to take care of him this week? Me? Really, ma'am? Uh, mm hmm Since I know you love animals, I'm sure you'll do a good job with our class pet. Are you up to it? You bet I am! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. uh, uh, why can't you stay still? I got him! Whoa! Come on, let me hold him! Me first! <laughs> hey, stop it! Huh? You're being cruel to him! What? We're not being cruel. I just wanted to play with him, that's all. That's right. Huh? Come here and give it a try. <laughs> uh. 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 No, I broke his tail! Lizard and gecko species drop their tails when they feel they're being threatened. Oh, oh man! Oh, that's mm. gross. Listen, their tails hold valuable nutrition, so losing them can be really bad. I'm taking him home to keep him safe, and you can't touch him anymore. Okay. I'm sorry, little guy. It'll grow back soon. You need a name, huh? From now on, I think I'll call you Finn. <laughs> <laughs> Is that better, Finn? <laughs> Eat up, okay? <laughs> <laughs> the we should play dodgeball. Huh? Yeah! <gasps> <laughs> that good? I see your tail grew back. That's great. Oh, your water's empty. I'll get you some more. <laughs> huh? What's this? Fire! Fire! I didn't do it this time! Uh, it wasn't us! <laughs> Everyone, this way! What's, What's happening? happening? There's a fire downstairs. Single file line and follow me. Right! right. <laughs> huh? But then <laughs> Everyone all right? Yes, I think we've got all the students outside. Wait, hang on. Charles isn't here. What? Oh. Charles! Hey, Finn. Now we can go. But we can't go that way. 
This is bad, huh? Oh. Don't worry. We'll make it out of here. <coughs> Over here, look! I can't get out! It's Charles! Huh? He's in the classroom! <gasps> Charles! 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 Huh? Roy, he's in their classroom on oh. the second floor! Great! Got it! <laughs> <coughs> Help me, someone! Uh. I'm here! Roy! <sighs> Okay, you ready? Yes. Here we go. The fire's all put out now. Thank goodness no one was hurt. <laughs> Roy, thanks for saving me today. <laughs> Charles, what you did was incredibly dangerous. When a fire breaks out, you must leave all your belongings and get out as fast as possible, no matter how important it might be. Don't run off by yourself. Listen to your teacher and follow their instructions till you get to a safe place. Hit the fire alarm if you're the first one to see it. Cover your nose and mouth from smoke, duck down, and leave quickly. If the fire gets so bad you can't escape, run to the roof and yell for help. Got it, Roy. I'll remember. Sorry for making you guys scared. That's all right. Since you did that, you saved our class pet's life. Yeah, you saved him. Oh. <laughs> hey, Vince tried to say thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the tickle! <laughs> <laughs>
Look out! Peter, you all right? Yes, Roy. Thank you. Listen, don't you know how dangerous that was? You two could have gotten really badly hurt. We won't do it again, Roy. You guys, I know skiing and sledding can be a lot of fun in the winter, but you must remember, don't go anywhere that looks too steep or isn't a designated trail. Stick to slopes that were designed for you. Racing can be dangerous because you go too fast or don't pay attention. Ride together and always stay focused. Before doing winter sports, make sure your body is stretched and ready for action. Always remember to wear a helmet, knee pads, and gloves for protection. Remember that safety is always the most important thing. Yeah, we'll, we'll do, do better, better Amber. <laughs> Everyone ready? Yeah! So, let's ride! <laughs> Finally, sledding time! Helly! Oh, I don't remember saying you were done. Uh, but... but I... I just want to sled! <laughs> Helly, get your 